Hello everyone and welcome back to Goddess of Victory! Nike! Alright. New event. What is this? It's oh it's the Twitter event. Yeah, I did that. We have a new update coming out. New character, Rosanna. New costumes, new event, Queen's Order. New seven day login event, that's nice. Coordinated operation. Some more co op stuff. Solo rates coming back. June 8. Mm. Alright, cool. Let's claim our stuff. Friend stuff as well. Claim the daily stuff. Claim the outpost stuff. Wipe out. Uh huh. All right, cash up. Now the normal shop. I'll build you everything you need. Hope you put it to good use. I'll buy this for the 300k. I think it's worth. We've got company. Welcome to reset. I also also buy this one. It's another level just for 600k credits. I think it's worth. What are you um, Just name it. I'll save Quincy for tomorrow. Just in time, dear client. We can buy one of these later. Have fun shopping. Definitely want the dewater ones. Spending another successful transaction. Thank you for coming. Another successful trans. Hello, this is the electronic. All right, that should be it. Let's go for the bunny event. Uh, it's the last day, right? Actually, no, two days. Okay, so we have time. Quick battle, all of them. Nice. It would have been nice to play around with them for a bit longer. Claim all of these. Okay, let me check the weekly just so I'm sure. Yeah, so it resets tomorrow, so we need to do the stories today. Alright, let's start with Ark. Uh, simulation room. Second simulation begins. Uh, wake me up when the battle is over. Attack increase, definitely. Simulation. It's going to be a bore, isn't it? Attack increase. Uh, I think I'll go for circle buff. How are things here, sweetie? Doesn't really matter. Mm, not looking good. Doesn't really matter. Take your time. We have all the time we need. Gain one run buff. Already? Sure. All right. Back I up. Any slack anymore. Nice. I'm not pulling any punches. And let's go. Oh, wake me up when the battle is over. Enemy system. Hacking completed. Looking forward to this. I'll be with you until the very end. Target lock. Men's bombardment. <laughs> One more down. Reload. They're awfully hard to operate. I'm still reloading. Give me a second. I'm reloading. Hacking to looking. I'll take care of this. And you can take that to the bank. Fire to the front. It would have been nice to play around with them for a bit longer. Loaded ammo. And that none. Cool. Let's click arena. Welcome to a arena. We All right, I lost rank. I'll look into that later. Not important right now. Let's go back. 
inventory, open these 17 boxes, get the 6 million, we are at 24 million total, back to the outpost. Alright, recycling room, we should have an upgrade of the general research, that's a bit of health. Of course the bulletin board, nice. Claim that. Let's start upgrading our Celine. That's four levels. That's pretty good. Is that all? I want to keep getting stronger. Almost level 200, and then we just start upgrading Ray to 200. We are at 5.5k plus the amount of boxes we have. All right, claim, uh, win three battles in the Ricky arena. Looks like we have to battle. All right. Let's give a warm welcome to the challenger. All right, we have to fight the Hina now. Let's get this show on the road. Hacker ready. ready. things out that's all okay we're reaching the 2200 mark just gotta fight he now again Twenty-two hundred mark. Perfect. I still don't know how I get these, right? I guess I should get them shortly, but like, it takes so long. And I'm first in almost every category. And I'm not getting them. So how do I get these? Annoying. Okay, claim that. Um, I need to advise Nikes. 
But let's do the tribe tower first. Ah, that's the tetra tower. It's the one we cannot do yet. Unfortunate. So no tetra tower today. That's fine. All right, let's do some advising. Commander. Starting with Quincy. Uh, if today comes that I start living up on the surface, what will become of me? You'd be right there with me for roaming freely up on the surface. You think so? I wonder what it would feel like uh, living up on the surface. What would we like? I hope to experience it soon. Let's see, I have another pleasant session. Nice, Modernia. Commander, Neon keeps yelling out firepower every time she sees me, but my name is not firepower. Maybe she doesn't know my name? You may not have memorized your name yet. You should repeat it more often. But I know Neon's name. Fine. When I see her, I'll keep repeating my own name. I talked with Marion about correlation between Neon and firepower. Eh. I've really started enjoying the running the mall recently. What should I put on the main banner this week? A product with unrealized potential. Hmm, that might be a gamble, but I also think it's a good way to open up new possibilities. The customers won't get tired and the uh, suppliers won't be able to try a fresh approach. I would end up the conversation with Rupi about running a shopping mall. Celine. I want to buy a breed of coffee, so I went to the cafe and asked for an Americano. But the employee there said a kid shouldn't be drinking coffee. How rude! We'll go to a different cafe next time. For sure, I'm never going there again. There are plenty of other cafes around. I feel a lot better off than talking to you. Absolutely look for other cafes. Visible. Darling, have I done something to upset you? No. Ah, I'm glad. I thought you were quiet because you were getting bored of me. Have a deep discussion with Isabel. Alright, blank. There are times when we come across a rude customers. Do you think we should handle them? Let me take care of them. Owners' customers can be pretty intimidating. Are you sure you can handle them? Either way, hearing you say that makes me feel reassured. Don't worry though, I'll deal with them myself. Thanks for your concern, pit boss. Why can I think about ways to deal with rude customers? Another one? You know, Splend, I mean, the food we are always stuffing now. We're supposed to wonder food. This name's so bland. It might be better if I had more mouth watering name. Juicy Perfecto. That's a little better, maybe. I think it needs some, some work. Still, I appreciate you giving it some thought. At least I talk about profound uh, effect naming can have. Neon. Firepower, 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 firepower. Firepower. Firepower, 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 firepower. You know, I continue shouting firepower. Cool. And D. Before you reach a decision on something, are there any other factors that you consider? What impact my decision will have on the world? It might sound somewhat ignorant, but that's true. Some decisions can have a significant impact on the world. Therefore, you must deliberately on every dis deliberate on every decision you make, big or small. Once you decide, there's no going back. Have a conversation with D about consequences of our actions. I knew you were a good person. Nice. So that's I'm done. Not some homicidal maniac who kills indiscriminately. Of course not. Let's go to liberation. Claim and claim. Two more days for the quest. Uh huh. What else do we do? I guess we can claim this. Another five. We need two more. Recruit Nikes. I guess I can do that. This is the social point once. Participating in campaign is something I'm doing right now. Wow, that thing's quite terrifying. We are 500 Do ahead. There? Okay. So far, so good. We've reduced their numbers significantly, and we're not too far behind them. 
a little more, and we'll be able to catch the leading group as well. Then it'll be us versus the carriers. Well said. With that being said... Maxwell hands a gun to Laplace. This is... Your gun is attached to your weapon system. So you're unable to use it right now. Use this. But with this... Laplace, may I say something? Anything. I can take it. I'm not so sure about that. I doubt your fragile mind would be able to withstand all my criticisms. Ugh. You're obsessed with being a hero. You're brash and sometimes moronic. You always preach about being a hero, but end up making all the other Nikkeis jealous by hogging all the attention from Suen. But you're longing to uphold justice. To be a righteous individual. I believe it's genuine. Going by hard numbers alone, I don't think there's any Nikkei in the Ark as strong as you. No, I'm not strong! Who are you to question me? Don't be irritating. I can't stand being questioned by someone less intelligent than me. I'm way smarter than you too, so no talking back to me either. Hardly. You both are equals. Oh, really? <sighs> no more excuses about Nymph. Take this gun and use it. Protect your life. You're the one who caused this. Don't think you can get out of this so easily. That's right, you bastard. I'll show you once and for all that villains are better than heroes. If you want to try and prove me wrong, then quit standing there and move to the front. Drake walks forward. <laughs> Drake actually saying something touching. I never thought I'd see the day. I've done all I can do for you. As for the rest, you must do it yourself. Use Masilla's technology to be the best you can be. Is that not the Matisse way? Maxwell walks forward. <sighs> How can I... Laplace stares at the gun Maxwell gave her. I can't do it! Don't give up. Gently push Laplace forward. <gasps> I've got your bag, hero. Birdie! Rapture's up ahead. Get ready! We'll attack them from the rear! Engaging! Engaging! Let's go. Don't worry. I'll handle it. I can do this in my sleep. Wait! I'm reloading! I'll be looking forward to that. Back to the front! Until the very end! can stand in my way. You want me to go engaging? I'd rather not walk. All right, noobs, can you hack it? Looking forward to the fire to the front until the very end. These are awfully hard to operate. One more time. Looking forward to the fire to the front until the very end. There we go. With me on your team, did you expect anything is, else? Can we fight the boss or are we too weak? I'd rather enemy sighted. We are a bit too weak. That's alright. You can always leave it for next time. Claim this. Get this reward. That's another hundred. And claim this. That's another ten. Which gives me 305, which is just enough to do another pool for Noir.
Which ended up with me getting fucking nothing. Oh well. That's life. I really enjoyed our conversation yesterday. Alright, that's done. Um back to the outpost, I guess. We have lots of stories to do. Four of them, in fact. But they, uh, they might turn to have a uh, sequel. Let's start with Rupee. Library. Ghost story. Eleven PM. Outpost Library. Hi, my lovely Lupins. Thanks for tuning into the Rupees Shopaholics Anonymous. You may be expecting me to throw money around flippantly, but no, I've got something better. Today's vlog is about ghost stories. I chose this topic because many of you are interested in these seven outpost mysteries. Shall we go ahead and introduce our special guest? Joining us once again is the spectacular commander. Hello. Next, we have the self-proclaimed unscarable Drake. If anything, this will just put me to sleep. A laughing stock is precisely that, regardless if they are living or dead. You certainly talk a big game. However, the important thing is... Will you feel that way by the end of our program? Alright, let the adventure begin! 11.30pm, library first floor, reading room. Before we start exploring the library, I'll give you a short explanation about this place's backstory. This library is home to one of the seven mysteries of the outpost. When the clock strikes midnight, behind the fourth bookshelf, it's said that you can hear cries of an anguish. There's a rumor that voices from a ghost sealed within the book, or someone buried alive in the library walls, crying out for help. Today, we are here to find out the truth behind it all. Ah, easy peasy. I can locate rapture radio signals. Ghosts are for child's play in comparison. We're counting on you. Of course I am, cause I'm awesome. Midnight. Can everyone see? It's midnight, and we are currently in front of the fourth bookshelf. According to the rumor, we should hear wailing. Maybe the ghost is too stupid to know we are here. I'll knock and let it know. Oh, wait! Hmm, see? No response. Ah! What the hell was that? Poltergeist. Poltergeist? That's when a ghost appears and causes physical disturbances, like moving objects or making sounds. At least that's how I understand it. So if it's a poltergeist, where is it? Yeah! You're too loud, Rupi. That wasn't me. Uh, okay. Well, it's really here. Even the courage of Drake has gone quiet. Would you shut up? Da 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 da. A ghost is running right for us. No. Run while hugging Rupee. Run! We've only moved a few steps when a door behind us opens. Where is the sound of footsteps drawing near? Uh, I was wondering who was making such a ruckus. I should have known it was you. Look back. Weak link. Uh, what? I'm just glad you aren't a ghost. What? You need to get your head examined. Listen up, I've got an important mission early tomorrow morning. I put a lot of work into it, and I don't need you Nimrod screwing it up. So get out of here before I really get mean. This is your last warning. Understood. Wouldn't want to disturb your studies. Let's head back, fellow Nimrods. Yes, but all those sounds we heard today, you didn't make them by any chance, did you? What sounds? Here I was pounding on the walls, because you were all being so damn loud. What? What about all that screaming? Yeah, that, that's the one. Uh, let's get out of here, now. Good idea. Uh, 
All right, that's a gift. Okay, three more stories. Uh, no fear, no failure. Friendly bar. As I walk into the bar, I see Pepper and Blank sitting together, drinking. Hey, Commander! Hey, boss! Why are you? If you don't mind, Blank, I'm the one who called him over. If you're feeling blue, I think Commander might be able to help you more than a doctor. That's not what. Uh, that's not to say a doctor is useless. Hmm. What happened? Oh, it's nothing. Blank, what did I tell you? You have to speak up whenever you're having trouble. It's not healthy to keep everything bottled up inside. There's no need for any forced smiles. No one can be happy 24-7. Hmm, I guess you're right. What on earth is going on? Did you and Nor have a tiff? It's not that. Hell, what freeze over before Nor and I got into a shouting match? You must know, I made a mistake during today's rehearsal. We've got a big show coming up tomorrow. Everyone makes mistakes. That's exactly what I've been trying to tell her. Everyone makes mistakes. It was just a rehearsal, wasn't it? Yes, but that was the first time I've ever made a mistake. I can't get over it. What happened exactly? I have to whirl around while I'm on the top of the pole. It's supposed to be grand finale, but I keep screwing up. Always slip off right over the pole. No matter how many times I try. Keep falling off at the same spot. The big show is tomorrow. I didn't have any problems before and now I can pull it off to save my life. I can't believe this. People often make mistakes with things. They feel they are proficient in. What good does that to me? I've got to do better tomorrow. I have to. Hmm. Why don't you try again in here? Huh? In here? Sure, there's a pull right over there. Good idea. Why don't you give it a try? I think you're so worried about making a mistake that you're psyching yourself out. Just relax and don't think about it too much. Hmm, got it. Blank walks to the front of the stage. Phew, alright. Blank begins to climb up the pole. So far so good. Her performance is flawless. Hmm, this is the part. Phew, huh? Ah! Although Blanks almost slips off, she manages to grab the pole quickly with both of her hands. Ooh. Ooh. She successfully completes the finishing move. Herself and the pole united as one. Wow, awesome! Got it, Dad, right? Made it! I couldn't do it before. You did great. What matters most is that you did not run away from your fears, instead, you faced them head head on. If you'd kept evading it out of fear, you would never have gotten past this stumbling block. Thanks, you guys. I think tomorrow's show is gonna be do gangbusters. I'm sure it will. Thanks again for all the help. Don't mention it. After all, what are the doctors for? Although I would like to reiterate, whenever you're upset about something, just say so. The same goes for you when you're feeling sad. To confide in others is the bravest thing of all. If you keep everything to yourself, no one will ever know how much you're struggling. Mm. Looks like I've got a patience waiting for me. Gotta go. Commander and I can't wait to check out your show tomorrow, Blank. Nicely done today. Okay, Noir, and I will be sure to put a killer show for you guys. Pepper leaves the bar in a hurry. Feeling better? Yep, thanks to you. If I didn't bungle that move again, I would have had to change the movements or ask Noir for help. I'm glad he pulled it off. Hey, <laughs> yeah! Blank leaps out of her chair. I can't believe how my emotions get the best of me. I gotta work hard on, my, uh, on this upcoming show. I was just a bit nervous since I've never experienced anything like that before. You and Pepper really saved my skin. Nora has been worried sick, even though I told her not to. I gotta get back and tell her that I'm all better. But before I go... Ah. Small thank you for listening to my troubles. Go get them, tiger. You betcha. Don't forget to come to the show tomorrow. I'll be more motivated knowing that you are there. What a miss it for the world. Blank heads out of the bar, beaming from ear to ear. The next day, Blank's show is a resounding success, garnering widespread critical acclaim. Alright, that's good. 
that's another gift. Fifteen more stories. Uh, let's go with the weird world of Drake. Anyone here? Ultimate villain. Drake is here. Wow, ultimate villain? Nito. Well, well, look who's here. You're too kind. Hehe. <laughs> What brings you to here? We came to get some clothes for Drake. You don't say. I do say. People have been getting a little too chummy with me. How's that supposed to make a dastardly fiend like myself feel? You are still the ultimate in villainy. Please, no need to state the obvious. When it comes to villainy, there is no other. I need to strike fear in people's hearts the moments they see me. That's why I came to see some clothes. Mwahahaha. Hmm. In that case, this may be the best store for you. My queen! We don't have much clothing suited for villains. You don't have anything for villains? Um, uh, my queen? Perhaps we could use the clothes we do have to fix something for our fiendish friend. Huh? I want you to make me something to be feared. Alice, are you sure about this? Why not? I would love to cook something for for Madame Villainous. I'd hate to have her empty-handed. Very good. I'm glad you can accommodate me. I'll let you get to it. You're not serious, are you? Of course I am. I could use a change. Oh boy, I'm so excited. Me too. Are you sure this is okay? Alice seems happy enough. Let's see what happens. Madame Villainous. Voila! With this, you can be the finest rabbit villain of them all. R rabbit villain? <laughs> Nobody laughs. Isn't it adorable? I'm allergic to rabbits. Oh, really? It looks like Alice is sad. No doubt, she's a villain. That's too bad. I would have liked to see a rabbit defeat a queen of hearts. Oh, do you have anything else? Mm, let me think. How about a cute puppy mask? Kinda like dogs, so I'd rather not. How about this then? Aren't these frills just the cutest things? Um, I'm also allergic to frills. Or what are these suspenders? It even got a Cheshire cat pro pattern. I have a phobia of cats. This one's my favorite. But damn, villainous, how about. I think I should be going. I haven't found anything for you yet. I just remembered that I have an important meeting. I absolutely have to attend. If I leave now, I should still be mm, still make it on time. One day I'll wear something you recommended, I promise. <laughs> well, I'll be off then. Drake Grace is out of the store. I'll have more prepared for you next time, Madame Villainous. Cool. And one more. Best this lucky friend. The maid cafe. Welcome, bestie. Commander. What are you doing in the maid cafe? I, I work here. You're telling me you work at the cafe? Yeah, this place has a lot of customers, and I hear it's easy to talk to people and make friends. I asked Ada if I could work here for a day. So, have you made any friends? Not yet. Actually, you're the first customer. It's been a dead today. Coco and Ada went out of, on business and soda is cleaning. I see. Actually, I think it's great that we don't have any customers. Why? Because I wouldn't know what, uh, what to do if we ha did have them. Just the thought of it makes me my mind go blank. And I... Break out in a cold sweat. Maybe I should just give up. Let me help you. You could command her. But, but, but how are you planning on... Oh jeez, a customer. Just calm down and greet them. Okay. Oh, welcome. Misty, pit boss. Blank. Fancy meeting you two here. Blank enters the maid cafe. I'm bowling the surrounding curiously. While Blank isn't paying attention, I lean over to Vesti and whisper in her ear. Vesti, try making friends with Blank. 
But blank. It's a customer, isn't she? I guess you're right. This place is usually packed with girls, so I always steer clear of it. Seems like today's an exception. Where do I order? Uh, over here. Huh? Since when did you start working here? Uh, I will. He's only here for the day. Uh, fair enough. Well, what do you recommend? Uh, um. Bestie finds herself tongue tied as Blank peruses the menu. She'll be there all day, stammering unless I do something. Recommend something on the menu. A recommendation? Uh, the parfait here is delicious. I personally think the strawberry ice cream is the best flavor. Much better than the vanilla, I think. Oh, and it goes wonderfully with it. some chocolate syrup drizzled on top. Yeah, I'll have that then. Y y you will? Why not? Since you give it such a glowing recommendation, I've gotta try it. Uh, okay, I'll have Soda Star preparing your order. Thanks, Commander. Bestie whispers to me. A while later. Here's your perfect, enjoy! Well, it certainly looks delicious. Time to it again. Uh -huh. Blank takes a bite of the perfect, and her eyes widen. Do, do, do you like it? I love it! Huh? You do? Yes, in fact, this is the best perfect I've ever had. No kidding? You want a bite, pit boss? Sure. Take a bite. It's absolutely delicious. Hold you. How did you come up with this flavor combination, Vesti? Whenever I came here with Emma, I could never decide between the strawberry or chocolate. When I was deliberating, Emma told me, why not combine them the two? I followed her suggestion and found it delicious. I order this every time I come here. I should have this on the menu. I'm gonna recommend it this to Noir. Glad you like it. You got any other recommendations? Or I can try it out next time we come here. After the buffet, I think the Omuris is a close second. The way they prepared it is quite unique. Is it a kind with a ketchup drizzled on top? That's it. I'm a sucker for that stuff. It sounds like we have similar tastes. Sure does. Have you tried fried rice by any chance? No, I haven't. Oh man, you can beat it. Next time, Westy and Blank proceed to have a natural free-flowing conversation. A few minutes later. Why does it feel like someone is watching me? Hey boss, what are you laughing at? Nothing. It's just nice to see you two becoming such fast friends. You have friends? You two are chatting like a pair of old friends. Well, if the shoe fits, let's be friends starting today. Ah, uh, okay. Next time you can come to Coin Rush. Nora and I will show you a good time. Sounds great. Well, this was fun. I've got to meet up with Noir. You're around. Blank leaves the meat cafe in a hurry. How strange. Well, I could say whatever came to my mind in front of Blank. I think that we can become good friends. I feel the same way. Vesti gazes at the door of the cafe from which Blank just departed. A bashful smile spreading across her face. Nice. Uh, looks like we do not get another story. That's all right. Let's check the command center. I wasn't there for quite a bit, so maybe we have stuff to collect? No, not yet. All right. Um, let me check these rewards. I want to see how long the story is going to be. So yeah, after we finish the boss, there's still a lot of story. So I'll leave that for tomorrow. Hmm. Do the friends. Uh, cannot do anything there. All right, let's have a look at the arena. Bonjour! Welcome to Larina. It's the finest entertainment the Ark has to offer. Then, what do we do? Could try that one. But this one should be easy enough. So I'll try this first. 
Let's get this show on the road! I will show you what Eden is capable of. Enemy aircraft confirmed. That's a rank increase. Um, I'm gonna try this maybe. Yeah, let's try it out. Ready? Let's see how it goes. Commencing operation. Okay, now this one is the one that matters. Can we do this? That heal from noise is crazy. Yeah, sad. Alright, um, today's gonna be a very short stream compared to the other days. I don't wanna uh, start with the story because then it would just take too long. So tomorrow is gonna be a bit longer again because we'll have more campaign story. Giving up so soon. And the day after will be also longer because we'll have the new story. So at least something. Some progress. Uh sadly we cannot do tribe tower. I still didn't do interception today, so let's go do that right now. And yeah, for good something. Interception it is. Close to rank 6, but not quite. That's alright. 
Rank 5 is ordered better than what I had yesterday. So that's done. Uh, simulation room done, interception done, arena done, tribe tower we cannot do, low sector we cannot do, uh, hard campaign we cannot do, normal campaign we did, recruiting we did, yeah, we're done. Let's just equip what we can and call it a day. So, hopefully we can get Noir tomorrow, if not, that's unfortunate, sadly we'll only have blank, which is still fine. Prefer blank over noir anyways. And yeah. I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow. So thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.